picks of the week. So my pick this week is the Boxy app for the iPad. Um, I, it, it's it's interesting, and I have a copy here right now, but mine is not fully functioning. Uh, I had it, and I, and I unsynced it with the other one. Pretty much what it does, it syncs to the media device. So if you have a Boxy box, it syncs to that, and you kind of have ev all the access that you would have on the media device. Or if you have Boxy installed on a computer, you could sync it with that, and all your media con all your media is there, just pings back. So it's actually mm -hmm. easy. If you hit uh, my media, it's going to email you a link code, and with that link code, it'll um, it'll set you know whatever you have on your on your computer to the iPad. It's a really nice dev de de design. It's pretty streamlined to the original Boxy look. Even if you don't stream it, you have some media down here. So they have the featured context there. So you could go through that and you could watch a couple of videos. But it's a great, great uh, little app. And I'm glad that they're getting on the iPad. And I'm glad that they're kind of, you know, making your uh, stuff on the go. So if I do have content that I watch on my Boxy, now I can watch it on my iPad.